hold off that lobby position. If you know nobody's pushing that way, C is safe. The rotation can come, the lean can come from the rest of them as the shots get traded out. So cast is found, and now Scream knows the majority of the players and crew are still hanging out towards a lobby. Well, and the thing is, their Scream was in a, or excuse me, Soulcast was in a pretty rough spot, right? Yeah, like he was in sure. that cubby. He only had 45 HP after the initial touch. So for him to walk away with at least getting one kill and weakening up Delsic a decent amount, that that's a win. That feels good. Seconds left. Kesnit hearing the turret just on the other side. He's going to try to get the rotators here. Kesnit has possibly the round in his hands if he has the kills to come across on TL's rotation. Nevera from heaven now on that Sova. Can he put up the damage here just on the planter? That's going to be a bit on Klaus, but not enough as the rest of the utility is set up for post plant. It certainly didn't feel good. Nevera playing up in heaven. And you mentioned the flanks. There's one of them as Kesnit drops at the hands of Link. Oh. Now they can turn their attention to the site as Yampi creeps his way forward. He's going to check that first 50, swings around, drops him. Link does the same. That was pretty clean, Riv. Yeah, that, absolutely. That looked good. Feel really confident in it. You see they've dropped that lockdown, and yeah, if they continue to play things out, they'll farm up another. You've got Nagzad who's playing this cheeky little flank, wrapping his way around defender spawn. If he gets the timing right, it's going to be problematic, but Solkas and the rest of the team start to work their way forward. Again, it's a game of delay. If you can delay long enough for oh, Nagzad to get what? into a good spot, he's going to be able to rip this thing right up, and he does that. He's able to take care of Nevera. Klaus pushing in on the same side as well. Yampi left in that 1v2. Both players on crew are weak, but there's just not going to be enough time. Crew are on the board. Crew. The Leer is there, but you're going to have to get through the alarm bot. They managed to do so. There's still the defenses of Liquid that are still on the site, but they're beginning to crumble. Ooh. They fall apart. Crew is already taking care too. That's going to allow them to get onto the site. Should you allow them to get the spike down, but we'll see if Solkos and Scream are able to do anything to rip this bad boy back to the bear is there as well. There we go, shock dart. Only a bit of damage. Oh, doing quite yet, Solkos with four, oh, but Klaus, Klaus rips it back, Klaus gets three, we're tied up at two apiece. What was that? That's actually so much room for crew to work with, and yeah, you've got the gravity well, you buy him some time. The Hunter Fury's gonna come out as well, and holy smokes, that could be everything, as they're getting everything that they want. Link is an anchor oh, who refuses again. to give up an inch as he gets three on the round so far. Looking for more, four. Can he get the ace? Last player's in garage. Go out there, challenge it, man. Yeah, baby, give it to him. Link with the ace. Liquid at three. I think that if Link doesn't go super stay in there, yeah. Liquid may be in some trouble in that round. Absolutely. That cosmic divide gives them all the site agency they would need as Yampi trades one as Mazzino comes back there. Good little one for one there. Scream dashing back. Staying alive, has yeah. that op. In tow, also one point from having the Blade Storm to work with. For Crew, you know, we've talked a bit about how they like to lean towards mm -hmm. A. One of the other things that we have to draw our, our point, draw attention to, excuse me, when it comes to their play style is it's been slow. Right? Like it's been Always. it's been poke and prod at the beginning. Spike and for Liquid, down, as mid. you start to kind of figure some of that out, you're able to get these early picks that you may have not gotten at the beginning, and you can shut this down shut very down. effectively. Yeah, here they thwart shut crew down. too. They're like, how can we not find Scream? Oh, wait, there he is. Yep. And B. We just saw him at A, but he gets himself to a good position. We saw him leave that site immediately. And as the sniper, you always have to keep moving. Is the blade storm gonna come through here for Nags? And he's got a few more. There's gonna be two, but it's the eyes of Scream. Is he going to be able to lock down the site in time for Solkos to be able to get here? It doesn't even matter. Scream cleans it up. A three for him. Rainy here. Trying to find some frags for the team. The Empress is online, so it could be big for this round. As Yampi yep. in sewers is able to pick up a few with Link yeah. on the other side. Dude, he was in such a good spot there, and they had no idea that that's where he was through all of that. But crew yeah, finding some space to work with. They've gotten back on A, but you've got to get through the final bosses of Nevera and Link. Well, actually, just, just Nevera for now, as Link is still kind of playing a bit further back. Utility invested from the Astro to buy some more time, as you know, looking to get the spike down anyway and manages to do so, but still has so much in front of him. He still has to find his way through this 1v2. I see a gun fight to 1v1. Nevera drops down, manages to rip his face off along the way. A couple pistols to work with. And this is slightly different, right? This is much faster than what we've seen out from Crew. But as much as things change, they stay the same. If we're going back to A. They've gotten themselves in. This could be a good attack here. Yeah, Yampi goes down. His utility is gone, but Nevera is trying to rip it with the Odin. He can't get enough. No, he does get two there, but Solcash drops. Numbers advantage in favor of crew. The spike has made its way into the site. Op not landing initially. He does have the blade storm as well, so if he wants to get real spicy with it, I suppose he can go. But Liquid here, trying to find their way through. They have the Cosmic Divide to work with as well. They have a pretty comfortable lead. No 
real reason to save your way into this thing, right? You kind of want to roll the die and see if you can make something happen. First steps first, take care of that. The Hunter Fury's gonna come out. From his Zeno, try to clear out the player up in heaven. You just heard the Blade Storm come online as well, and that should be the cue that they want to take the fight, that they want to figure something out. He's playing this tight corner. The swing out from Keznit's so good, and he's going oh. hunting, baby. He's going aggressive. He lands the shots. Keznit gets four. We'll separate the map a little bit more in A. It's gonna be that hit again here for crew. Soulcast is in a good spot. Soulcast is in a good spot. He's able to get two with the Vandal. The flash to make sure there's nobody else, but you're good, brother. Ain't nobody coming at least quite yet. Now the spike makes its way in through short, and they still have the defenses. They're doubling down. Soulcast gets a third, a fourth. Okay. Liquid just kind of runs over. So there. He yeah. wasn't there a second ago, so he still has that op to hold the angle. And crew find themselves back on A. The smoke coming out from the Astro to create a bit of space to allow them to creep their way onto the site. And all right. Oh, the foot! The foot! No. You blew his toe off! To take that angle as well. Oh, my word. Scream gets one. Kesnit's going to answer back. That's a big frag that they have the site. TL's retakes have been fantastic, but how good can this denial be? There's the Cosmic Divide, and that's huge. Great play from Delzik. Yeah, it's going to be countered, though. They're going to drop their own Cosmic Divide Ooh. on top of the Null Command, so this this should be it for them. The they no want to go forward. Kesnit going aggressive, and he gets dropped at the hands of Link. What more do they have in their tank? They find themselves down to three members <laughs> left. Liquid with the advantage, and it's only going from bad to worse as Delzik drops. Liquid gets to eight. One guy takes oh. the space. Oh, oh, no. Right. Good crossfire. Oh, but Nevera's in a good spot. He's no, not just blindly what? walking through. The timing is great. Nevera, oh. get out of here, bro. Ah. The guy, he just joined the team. What the heck? Oh, can he be on the ground for a kill? Is, no. that, is that cool? No, it's oh more my fun God, this Nevera Delzik, however, Spike comes down. up Mid. and yeah. shuts us up as well. Liquid lose two immediately, and that could be a C site now. If they can push We're down and figure out where the rest of these members are, this is going to be what big. Nice push by Delzik. What else can he find out? Very nice push to take all of this away, and you've got a couple members that are very weak on the side of Liquid. But Scream with his one HP. And you saw Nevera drop the dart back there, back sight, really and make sure there was nobody pushing forward. Understanding Mazino is likely coming from this way. It's just a bit early, but gets the info. There goes Mazino trying to push beautiful. forward, takes care of Nevera. He, remember, he's got a couple of weak players. Ooh, better. Right, like, it, it, they're just using that better. They're using their utility to allow them to get onto the site to create some space. And yeah, it hasn't been hard hits, but they've been able to take it and get the kills that they need. Now we're seeing Nevera dropping the Hunter Fury. They push in at just the right time. is able to get two, but Mazzino, Mazzino's able to get two of his own. 3v3, Spike. A pretty tough spot here, but Scream, of course. Who else but Scream to give the numbers advantage back to Liquid? Mazzino's ratty little spot there is given away by the Alarm Bot, but they know the Van Exent's coming. They do now. Dashes away. He's up Nevera. How much more you got in you? 2v2. Just really nothing as far as armor left on the side of crew. Little gun pick up by Yampi. They're gonna go for the plant screen, watching full right side. This is the chance for Nagzet to make a move as long as he creeps it in. Now the 2v1, dog. The timing's, the timing's just not there. Right, like, Yampi low. Oh, Nagzet isolates them. Woo, dash away, Scream. Scream, Nagzet going hunting the classic no from the top, and Scream gets the three. Either he or Nagzet. Yeah. But that's where you see, like, Nagzet's playing a bit off, right? Like, if you want, give up A. Kind of fight around that. Yeah, trades it right back, right? Like we're back to equal footing. So he knows two in B. He can easily call that Spectre and a Vandal rotating over for him. B, that allows the team to know they're in sight. And Liquid just gets all this info that makes things seamless. And the knife. Spots one there. We see the Hunter Fury coming out from Mizino. He's linked so far back. Should be any problems as far as the utility from KO comes out. And Nevera takes care of things as well. It's just two left on the side of crew as Nevera gets the spike down. Planted. One step closer to getting that Hunter Fury online. Mizino up in heaven. Gone. Not able to do anything, man. As Nevera just clotheslines him. Start. And exit. Drop the, the, the blade storm right after he gets that kill. And Scream answers with one of his own. See the op gets put down as they want to go. Scream. Oh, a couple dueling One enemy remaining. jets. But for crew, that was great. Do they have drone? They actually bolt out beautiful. Now crew is going to have to reconsider this. They can actually destroy that lockdown if they do get a good shot on it. But Nevera is going to push right through, Doug. Kesnit did invest the, the Empress. So we'll see. Ah, it was just one. It was just one. Is Klaus looking to anchor things as well? Not able to do so. Delzik's left alone yeah. in this 1v3. Yampi getting the spike down. 
You're gonna have to pull off some sort of miracle, my guy, just to keep this map alive. But what can you do, the Spectre? That's all it really has is some util as well, but that's really it. Spike ticking away. Slowly playing time, but the turret's gonna uh, get his position away as soon as he swings out, right? Like oh, an understanding that. Ball. Drop set, yeah. Oh, but the oh, null oh, command oh. is so good! The null command wow. is so good! Soul cast gets three at the round. That was his like potential. Maybe I can make my way past that first box to get onto the site, but even that was stuff. Uh, comes an even scarier prospect when they really don't have footage to watch even from the first map. We just watched. Here we are towards B to start things off. It is gonna be the pressure from TL attacking first. And we heard the death saying it would be TL going up mid. Here they go. Yeah, they were absolutely right. Back and forth. And Kesnitz already dropped, right? Like the Reyna has an opportunity for things with the pistol, but no, the jumping classics oh. are traded back and forth. Numbers fit in fan advantage. Still in favor of Liquid as they funnel their way onto A to get the spike down. We'll see what crew can do as far as retake attempt goes. Doug, I love me a good around the world. That was fantastic. You don't ever see that. You usually get caught by someone, someone stays back. Uh -huh. B to mid to A. Let's see how crew answers with their post plan. You're just checking the weather yeah. in all the different <laughs> spots, right? It's a big map. Things can change. You never know. But as you said, what can crew Standing do ahead. as far as this retake goes? As soon as the dark comes out, you see the gravity while keeping them at bay. And you still have two players from Liquid who are playing off towards A long, so they're in a really good spot here. You're gonna have to deal with Link playing by Jenny, oh. and then still deal, deal still with the other playing back. And somebody down in hell. Nagza just has so much he has to deal with. Soulcast cleans him up. Drone up mid. Double duelist will be following. Oh, Nagzat has his work cut out for him as they round the corner. Ah. He makes quick work of kill number one. All right, screen. Screen out though. Gets a second. Ooh. Gets himself back to a healthy spot, but now Performazino cleans him up. There's still room for Luke to work here with here, but crew has arrived and they've been able to bolster their defenses. While well, they were able to bolster their defenses, this is Liquid's bonus, friends. Right? Like, yeah. This shouldn't be a fair fight. <sighs> quick and steady. That's how they've been Spike pushing planted. through here. I mean, quick trades into that mid area, especially taking down market so early, you know you can basically cordon off who is in B. It makes it very tough for crew, even if it is going to be that eco. And making his way through. Still has a few stars on that A. Not going to decide to use them. Well, at least for now, I wonder. Take some of that space away, but nobody's home. With that, crew should understand you've got your hands full towards yep. B. Excellent start from Klaus. Double drone push. Yampy destroys the door. Scream flashes through. The, the set utility right now is incredible. Ooh, Yampy able to take care of the first, but Kaznitz shows up at just the right time. As Klaus does as well, he's able to get three with the Sheriff. But Solkas takes care of one, a 1v3. I, mean, I have this guy. Spike. This would be something if he's able to pull this off. One, that's huge. All he's gonna get. Crew get on the board, a big one. Maybe floating around. Doesn't necessarily say this is our initiation, but the dash, there it is, into the site, onto Jenny. Right, and into a cloud burst, but not finding very much success as Delzik's able to clean him up right off the bat. But they continue to funnel onto the site. The Empress comes online as they try to create some space, as they try to take the site away, but Delzik manages three. to get three. One There's the op out from Nibera, but he's left alone with 11 health, and that's all that he has to him as well. Oh, it's a smoke. He drops the smoke to work his way through. That's beautiful. I don't think they're going to be suspecting that if he gets the timing just right. It's going to be a slaughter back side. He gets one. Klaus went back. Yeah, he's in a big spot right now. Oh, the dash does give him the upper hand on Kesnit there, Doug. Defender lockdown coming through is Klaus. Huge. Looking to put this round on his back, but Yampi left. continues to go aggressive. He continues to take space away, looking for the jugular of crew. And you see off of that liquid kind of rotating out. They understand there's so much space that's been taken away. It's a bit of a ring around the rosy. Now Nags are trying to work his way mid. Last Did he not? Ooh, ooh, just waiting for another one. Nevera rips his face off with the Sheriff with 11 seconds left. The spike should go left. down. Klaus, who was very formidable at the beginning of the round by himself. TL was even to one member that they knew was in B. Just go A, planet, safe, because Klaus is doing this. Our efforts towards A, and there's a ton of utility. 
Nags knows they're not coming B. He's already pushed with the off, so the rest of crew is here to defend. Will it be enough to take down TL? So far, one for one, not too bad, but Link able to take one back. Klaus is playing around the door, trying to find some space, trying to make something happen as 103 comes out as a counter out for Soulcast. He's able to take care of Kesnit. What more can he find? It's gonna be it, but through all of that, you talked about it, Riv. They had four there, and it was not enough. Link would still manage to find the numbers advantage, but Klaus tries to get him back. Liquid, all intention to go A for now. Uh-oh, that might change their mind. So clean. That was a he's in his own smoke there with just a little left. bit of peak. Spike down and the advantage a. is his as Kesnit drops another two left. Nevera and Scream, the brother buff, can it come into play? Empress in his back pocket. That's one. True, you don't win this 2v5, right? Make it a 3v1. Saw one. There it is. He's going to dance his way around through utility. Not able to land the shots at Mazzino. Alarm bot going off, but overall, less noisy take on mid. What a distraction bait. Oh my word, these two working together, Yampi. And Scream on the market side as he just starts going to town on the rest of the group. And that was a big confidence swing there, right? Like he just waltzes out and says, fine, I'll land the shots. And he's able to do it as Scream gets his way onto the third kill of the round. Left. And he's going to have an option at potentially getting Spike the fourth. Planted. No, Delzik takes care of him. But now Delzik finds himself in a 1v3 as Liquid. Yeah. But, had he been alive, maybe. 30 seconds left. Either way, I lied to you all. Ooh. I apologize. Zeno gets dropped after he gets one. Good. Cosmic oh, fight out. out. We'll see what they can do as far as holding him back. Nags mm. at. He drops and really off of that. There's still there's so much room for Liquid to work as they're going to be able to take the site and get spike down. Left. The two remaining members of crew are just now starting to approach the site. It's gonna take heroics out of Kesnit. That Empress, I right? gotta make something happen here. As it goes in, 3v2 situation. Yampy low, but the operator is still able to score some shots on the way in. Kesnit okay. with a big frag. Yep, yeah, that's one. Missed. The oh my is word. Just too much, man. The nano swarms keep him back. The Astral Util as well. And then they have a decent spot where Link is down. So he's playing a dangerous position. Usually a one and done if you cannot get yourself a few kills here. Yampy drops one. Klaus still very close. Is he going to be able to do what he does? Yampy's down. Yeah, but there's still so much more. There's still so much oh. more. The lockdown comes through. The Cosmic Divide and the Hunter's Fury as well. As Mazzino's trying to keep things back. But Link cutting off the rotations, keeping crew at bay. It all falls on to Mazzino. He had that what? ultimate early on. That was nice. Okay. Spicy. Pop off, King. What else you got? A 1v3. It's going to take more than just that, though, to get crew back to four. Shock dart. Nothing. Nothing doing at all. So you've taken down yeah. the controller. No Take smokes the there for TL, so you control the angles that you want to create with Delzik. They're still going to try for a little bit. Utility going towards the top side, and they still want A despite the util. They're going right at it. 30 seconds left. You're absolutely right on the util. Yampi's also playing around three. Spike went down at the hands of Delzik. So they've gotten this far. They've gotten what they wanted, but you've still got to secure the thing. You still have to take care of the attempted retake coming out from Liquid. And you got Yampi with the Sheriff. And the Ion Sheriff, as we said, delivers automatic headshots. And we see it on full display there. Nevera is able to get one as well. This is just so clean and serious. That stings. Yeah, I think seeing the activation on the turret said, I feel like this could still be a play. KJ is pretty close. And now it is. It's going to be crew going in. Now, again, they've taken a sight, but it seems like TL is just all quiet about it. And they have to take her Scream, who's in market, right? If they don't take her Scream, it's going to be problematic because they're going to be able to push him from that sight. You see the Reyna Kesnit on the side of crew holding down that angle. They're able to take care of back sight. Good. Oh. And now, crew, now they're going to have to deal with the aggression coming in. Kesnit spots Scream. And there he was. One Understanding the Bears there as well. And Mazino kind of close lines him. They get the, the, the kills that they need for crew to get to four. Scream has to. The back up. I like this from Crew. They've taken the space that they wanted. The, hunt, the Empress is coming out online as well for Kesson. Oh, they have Mazzino. I was like, everybody's looking the same way. It scared me for a moment. Nevera picks one up. Snags it, staying out of the spam. And it's the slow peak from Yampi. How far back are they? And now he comes to flank from door. Yeah, I wonder if he's just checking for space or yep. for information. There it is. actually going to double down on his whole cast. They would have taken care of one. As he starts to drop down, he spotted another walking into the Astro Smoke, understanding there's likely a good chance there's one down in hell, and there is. They're going to have to isolate him. Nagzat gets it to a 1v1. The Blade Storm comes online. He tries to go up top. 
not even land the shots. Scream swings Scream. around, but next it gets the third of Red Bull Clutch for Crew. Analyst ask? Nine three curse, bro. We talked about it. Hunter, uh, okay, the Hunter's Fury, or excuse me, the Cosmic Divide, but Liquid put their foots down. They do not give up an inch, but maybe Kesnick can find more Another. success. The Operator's there. Delzik's able to take care of him. The reinforcements from Liquid have arrived. Cosmic Divide cuts off Market, cuts off Spawn. Three are already right waiting. Planted. Soulcast, Link, and Nevera. All ultimates are up. How do they decide to use these? Kezin is in such a brutal spot, too, playing down towards B main. Like, you have to deal with him if you want to work your way in through lane. Soulcast is coming through. Oh, Delsic may be in trouble. Yeah, Delsic's <laughs> a sitting duck, bro. He never had a shot there. Link gets two. The double ops set up Nevera. Gives that initial angle away. He retreats back a bit. Still has that operator there. The lockdown comes online, and there it is. If it's not the lockdown, it's the operator. Nags. But Nags that's able to trade that right back. Nags all catch what? drops as well. 13 seconds left. They still have to get the spike down, though. The two and remaining members left. of Liquid now showing up. You hear the uh, blade storm comes online, courtesy of Yumpy. Now they approach a retake of their own double duelist. What can they do here? Nothing spotted yet. The remaining members are all on the side as Yumpy has to clear out every single corner just to make sure. There's nothing going on behind him. Now they can approach things. I believe he may have spotted an exit shoulder. Oh, no. Ooh, baby, that was close. Oh, one. He goes in aggressive, looking for the second and the third. And why the heck not? Dueling blade storms. It's a dog fight up in the sky. Scream pushing his way forward. We talked about it, the 1v2. He's going to have to get the kills and still get the defuse. And no, Nagzit gets to four. I wonder how they find value with Nagzit's operator. Like, oftentimes, you're doing a little, little cloud burst dash, mm -hmm. cause some chaos. But with an operator, and surely not. Oh, Link, you crazy son no, of a gun. Link manages no. to get two and stays alive. Now he drops, but Nevera Sheriff gets three. What? That's the one that they win? That's how they get to 12? We'll see TL is okay with giving that up. It's when they start to break these sight walls down, and it could happen here. They get stuck by a digital. Molly and Scream picks one up. Hunter Fury came out. The kill was traded out. 30 Courtesy seconds left. Of Kesnet, Link. Playing that anchor backside again, playing contact off of the turret. Kesna just walks right into his crosshair, and Link's able to clean him up. But Nagzet! Next! Ooh, ooh Mazino does it. All right, a 2v2. Nagzet still playing up in heaven, able to upgrade his weapon. Link gets things cleaned up as Nagzet gets into a 1v1. The op in his face. How has Nagzet avoided things up until this point? I don't know that he's going to be able to pick up the spike and plant it. Uh, yeah, they've run out of time. It's not going to be enough. Team Liquid, wow. map one was clean. Map two was a Defenders bit more win. spicy, courtesy of Crew. But Liquid looks so strong in their opening series here, champions. They did indeed. I think at the end there, they were kind of waiting and relying on the shots they'd been hitting. And Crew turned up the heat a little bit. So Liquid definitely have something to look at there. But 